If you're using CCDC contracts to manage your construction projects, you need to see this. I've been using CCDC4 unit price contracts for the last 12 years now, and five years ago, I had enough of the manual, repetitive data entry required to keep track of all of our job site progress and change orders. I'm going to show you how we went from constantly being behind on our paperwork and having hundreds of Excel spreadsheets and Word documents to now using one simple platform that organizes all of our projects into one central hub. Whether you're an owner, consultant, or contractor, you understand that construction contract administration is in a constant state of flux. There may be conflicts on the job site, drawings change, the contract scope may change, extra work may be required. All of these require additional paperwork. Now paperwork is fine if you have time, but what if you're behind and you can't keep up? Manually transferring progress, quotations, or changes from another stakeholder's PDF or email to your Excel file can be tedious and time consuming. I'm going to show you how you could save 80% of the time it traditionally takes to create these documents today with contract complete. What would you do with that extra time? Let's go to my computer and I'll show you how it's done. All right, so we are on contractcomplete.com here. I'm just going to log in. I've already entered in my login information, so it's going to log me in automatically. We're logged in as a consultant here, as a landscape architect. And if I go to my contracts, I can see all of our contracts, all in one view, the different stakeholders, project names, total values, remaining quantities, amount, like, the amount of progress that's completed, and the percent complete, which is also kind of nice to have. All right, so if you if we go into our first contract here, Big Tall Forest, we're gonna do a change order. And what we're gonna do is we're gonna request some extra pricing, some pricing from our contractor. So what we're gonna do, what we've already done is, we've already set it up on Craig Leaf Court, we're gonna add 50 maple trees, 80 oak trees, and 90 locust trees, and you can tell we don't have this price in the contract, so I'm going to request it. You can see it automatically generates a CCN for us, uh, which we can either download or we can send through the system. And this gets sent to the contractor which I'll show you that view over here. So if I refresh this, this is the contractor portal. You can tell a proposed change requires pricing from Big Tall Forest. Tango Sorrentino has sent it. And all the contractor needs to do here is fill out the prices. Once that's done, they click save. And if we go back and refresh it, you'll notice that the prices are already loaded into the change order. So the next step for the consultant would be simply to Review the prices, say, okay, I'm on right with the total. And once you're okay with that, all they would do is select the change and create a change order. So I believe we've already done four change orders on this contract. Let's do the fifth. So we're going to select the stakeholders. You can add additional stakeholders here. And then this just gets sent out as a change order. Okay, looks good. Nice and clear. Original contract value, new contract value. 
and I certify that I have the authority to send out a change order. And now, as the contractor, you can see that there is a change order ready for signature here. And all I gotta do is open it for signing. Accept this disclaimer. can click to sign it. Now this is also handy on your phone. It's a lot easier to sign with your finger. But that's that. And if I go back, <clears throat> I can sign it as a consultant as well. And obviously you'd want the owner to be added to this change order. But this is just for demo purposes. So it's been signed by the contractor. Tango, and we're good to go there. Now once, here's the need. Now here's the best part. When both the consultant and the contractor and the owner have signed, close that. And you go back to your original contract. I'll show you the schedule of prices you can see that the change order has automatically been added to the bottom here. And these quantities can now be reported as progress to be included into, a, into an invoice. Now this is just one of the ways that Contract Complete helps to eliminate some of the manual redundant tasks that used to happen back in the day when you have to fill out an Excel file, PDF it or print it, scan it back to your contractors to fill out. They have to print it, fill it out, scan it back to you, and email it back to you. And then, you know, like in between there, there's email delays. So now everything's kind of lumped into one platform and centralized so that it's easily, uh, easily found and the process is just that much smoother. So I haven't even gone into, you know, when a document changes, it's all centralized. Uh, reporting progress can be done by any stakeholder and invoices that are sent by the contractors can be reviewed in the system and certified automatically with a couple clicks. And on top of that, we have an entire bid management platform that allows you to send out unit price contracts to be uh, bid on by multiple contractors. So if you're interested in learning more about Contract Complete, fill out the form below and we'll have somebody perform a customized demo based on your preferences. Thanks so much and have a great day.